Okay, we have what's called a double tapped breaker, and that is definitely not code. But if you look at this breaker, you can, this one is designed to put two wires in one terminal. And this happens to be a uh, square D home line. So I'll show you how we go about fixing this problem and maybe bringing it up to code. We have a tester here to make sure that second wire in that that's double tapping it is not connected to the same circuit somewhere. And this tester will tell you the voltages too. So what we'll do is we'll put this breaker off. We'll take one wire off of that terminal there. Put the other one back in. We'll tighten it up. Turn it back on, and now we'll check and see if this wire is being fed from the My tester doesn't seem to be lighting up. Okay, okay that wire is not energized. I'll show you how it lights up, same with the voltages. There we go, it's lighting on 120 volt. And they stripped it with a pocket knife and left some uh, debris on the uh, insulation, so we'll straighten this wire out. Back further. So we'll put the backs on here. So we'll put our breaker in the box here like this. And we'll make sure our wire is going in the hole here. in the hole, make sure our insulation does not get under the uh, pressure plate, and tighten it up. Put our slack back in here the way it was. And this will be, if I was wiring this, I would have square cornered everything. Okay. And we'll turn it on. Now we're going to make sure our cover screws are not going to hit any of the wires when I put this cover back on. Okay, so we put one, two, so we got to open up one on this side and all the ones on the other side there. So that is how to fix a double tapped breaker. Here in the country I was born in. We use a 12 American wire gauge on 20 amps, 14 American wire gauge on 15 amps, 
black is live, white is neutral, the gray or the green is the brown. Red and blue are also live colors, so however you may find white live in a switch loop or a 220-240 volt circuit, and the appliance does not require a neutral. Peace. Thanks for watching.